In my opinion, the only way to approach uh, the abortion debate, from my perspective at least, is to assume that the pro-life people, the militant ones, believe that abortion is murder. Regardless of whether or not I agree that abortion is murder, it's best for my own sanity to assume that they believe this. Um, this way you don't get all angry about the fact that, uh, uh, about what they do next, uh, protesting and walking around with pictures of aborted fetuses in front of women's clinics, which actually does take place on a daily basis uh, on the route that I take home on my bicycle. I pass by a woman's clinic. I have to get used to the sight of these people behaving like this. And one way of doing that is to um, assume that these people are sincere. I think that the Benetarian antinatalist point of view is best approached that way for some people as well. I'm not equating them really with the pro-life people um, in as much as I'm simply saying that in order to cope with that point of view, you have to assume that they're sincere. Um, you have to assume that they're sincere when they tell you that you're the ultimate evil, etc. Uh, that way you don't feel actually insulted in as much as you feel somewhat mystified by what they say. And, and from my perspective, when I get called that, I am more curious. I'm fascinated to find out that somebody actually believes that. Um, what else could I expect people to say if they actually do believe that I am evil, that I'm all these dreadful things? Um, uh, you know, what else can I expect people to do but to, to, to express that? Um, that, to me, is how you solve extremely intractable problems. If, say, an antinatalist equates um, reproduction, conscious and deliberate reproduction, with rape and murder, and a lot of antinatalists have used that uh, equation in their own arguments. I'm not dragging this in as a slander. What would I expect them to do? What, how would I expect them to behave if they sincerely believe that um, rape and conscious deliberate reproduction are morally uh, about equally offensive? Makes you think, doesn't it? Thank you.